Welcome to Made to Win. I'm John Latham. Now, if you're with us this last week, you know we had the final first trial results came in, and I'm going to be talking about that again this week, but I'm going to specialize on soybeans. Last week, we specialized, we talked about corn. So we're really proud of the performance. We had 31 wins this year in 2020 in the first trials, an outstanding performance. And we're really proud of not only the performance this year, but the consistency we've had over the last five years. You'll see 31 wins in 2020, 38 in 2019, 33 in 2018, 30 in 2017, and 40 in 2016. So 172 wins altogether. And if you think about all the different states we do business in, the soil types and the weather conditions, to have that kind of consistency is just outstanding. And we're really proud of that. Another thing we're proud of at Latham with our soybeans is our quality. It's something we've been known for for over 70 years and we take a lot, great deal of pride in. Uh, quality is written on every bag at Latham. We have the soybean options. We have six different trait platforms. So a record amount of trait platforms. We've got just the technology that works on your farm. And we also have the disease resistance at Latham. With ironclad is a, is a designation that we came up with for only the very best disease resistance. To, to cross over that bar, a soybean has to have a, an outstanding score in brown stem rot, phytophthora root rot, iron deficiency chlorosis, cyst nematode, and either sudden death syndrome or white mold. So that's a high bar. And we, we, I'll show you a lot of different soybeans that cross that bar. So, so to start out, I want to show you, this is our very first bean I'll talk about is the 0883. But the reason I, I want to talk on anything you'll see here is a winner in either the first trials, the super strips, or in the Latham research trials. So it's a winner and uh, really proud of all the different winners we have. I would encourage you, I'm going to go rather fast. If you want to look at the data more closely, just pause and you can look at the data then. But I'm going to go through a lot of different winners here. So we start off with 0883, and you can see in uh, 2019, it won the first trials, and in uh, 2020, it was the number one in our super strip at Fall Creek, Wisconsin. Next, 0995 is an E3, is an 09 E3, and it was also a winner. It won first place at Pelican Rapids, Minnesota, with a yield of 72 bushel. Next is the 1048 Liberty an outstanding uh, 1.0 maturity. It was first at Breckenridge, Minnesota, first at uh, Foxhole, Minnesota in 2019, and then first again at Foxhole, Minnesota in 2020. So very great consistency over the last several years. Next is our 1238. It's a real high performer for us, one of our top sellers, and it continues to do well. It was first place in Horace, North Dakota back in 2018. And you'll see uh, in Latham Research, it's done extremely well too. First multiple times, including this year, two different times and a yield of 84 bushel. So an outstanding 1.2 maturity Liberty. Uh, 1392 is a 1.3 E3 and it's performed very well. It won a couple of different super strips of Latham at 60 and 56 bushel in Minnesota and Wisconsin. And you can see here, we've got another page of all the wins and it also won our test 911 at Osage with a yield of nearly 80 bushel. Next our 1429 LLGT27. Outstanding performance it uh, won a year ago at Sanborn, Minnesota. And look at the wins this year in Frankfurt, South Dakota, uh, Watertown, South Dakota, and Beardsley, Minnesota, all wins in 2020. Here's some more wins uh, in the Latham research in three different tests in 2019. And you'll see two here in 2020, another one in Glendon, Minnesota. This is a real high yielding 1.4 maturity. Next, we go to 1.5 maturity E3. You'll see at Watertown, South Dakota was the winner uh, in our super strip in 2019. And then this year at Renville, Minnesota, it won at 78 bushel. Next is our 1.6 LLGT27. You'll see in 2019, this was a winner at Webster, South Dakota. It won three super strips in 2019, and it won three super strips in 2020, and uh, it done well in Latham Research. So this 1648 is a real high yielder at 1.6 maturity. Next, at 1.7 maturity is a, is a Roundup to Extend variety. It's done extremely well. You'll see the different wins and a big win at Spencer, Iowa in our super strips in 2020. 1793 LLGT27, an outstanding product, one at uh, Sheldon, Iowa, 71.75 bushel in 2020. Here's 1858. I can go on for a long time about it. It has dominated in the first trials the last several years. It's one you'll see summaries 
in uh, 2018, it won a summary in 2019, it won a summary in 2020. So as a 1.8 maturity in southern Minnesota, this is tough to beat. It's a Roundup Ready to uh, soybean. There's a lot, of, a lot of yield results here to go over. Here, 1948 was a big winner in at Lamberton, Minnesota at 76.8 bushel in 2020. This is a great 1.9 maturity Roundup to extend. Here's some more yield results. You can see the performance over the last three years. Next, 1995 E3, an outstanding soybean. You can see the yield performance in 2019. It won three super strips in 2020. This is a great defensive package as well as a high yielder. So I really like the 1995. It's, it's an outstanding variety, uh, winning at uh, Watertown, South Dakota, Winthrop, Minnesota, and Alexander, Iowa. Next, 2184, this has been a, a superstar for us in our Extend lineup for several years. You can see going back to 2018, it won super strips in uh, 2018, 2019, 2020, 2.1 maturity, a really high yielding Roundup Ready to Extend. Next, 2193, this could be our top seller for the company. Uh, big wins in South Dakota in the first trials in 2019. You can see all the different uh, super strips that won in 2019. Great performance. Here's four big wins in, in the first in the uh, super strips in 2020 at 86 bushel at Garner, Iowa, 77, 76, 60 bushel. This is a real high yielding with and also an ironclad. So a great, great uh, product with both great offense and defense. Next, 2228, Roundup 2. This has been a high yielder for a long time. No surprise here. Uh, winner in uh, first trials in 2018, won again in 2020. And you can see the Latham research. It's been a, a big winner for a long time. Here's some more of the super strips. It's won. This is a real high yielding. If you can plant a Roundup 2, this would be a great one at 2.2 maturity. Next here is a 2.2 that's a great Liberty. It's won several times the last couple years, including at Pocahontas in 2020. And the 2295 has had an outstanding year. This is probably one of the highest yielders in our Roundup 2 Extend platform. You can see all the different wins it had in 2020 in our super strips. Uh, Burt, Iowa, Royal, Iowa, Albert City, Iowa, Sac City, Iowa, Lake City, Iowa. Outstanding performance in 2295. Here's some more wins. And this goes back to 2018. So it's, it's won every year the last three years in a big way. So this is a great 2.2 high yielding variety. Next is another high yielding extend. Boy, these two are outstanding. Look at the yield results. Three big wins in the first trials with 2549. Outstanding. This is a 2.5 maturity. It just misses ironclad. But this, if you're looking for something in this maturity, this is a really high yielder. We got here some more yield results. Uh, winning at Super Strips at Monroe, Wisconsin, Holstein, Iowa in 2019. Uh, it's won each of the last several years. Del Rapids, South Dakota, and Floyd, Iowa in 2020. 2597 E3 has, has uh, been a high yielding uh, variety for us at a 2.5 maturity. You can see it won the Super Strip this year at Iowa Falls, Iowa. 2894 E3, an outstanding product won two different first trials in 2020 and it won in, in eastern Iowa and central city Iowa and then it won the summary in uh, South Dakota southeast so you can win in South Dakota and eastern Iowa you know it can do well all over the place also won multiple super strips over the last couple years you can see in 2020 won three super strips so this is a, a 2.8 is a really high yielding performer uh, love this variety and then we go to a 3.1 maturity and you can see we got a great, this is an ironclad E3. It won our test 914 in Delmer, Iowa at 73.92 bushel against a lot of different varieties, including competitors. And then the last variety is a 3.4 maturity, uh, a great variety. Uh, this is a Roundup Ready 2 Extend. It won at Eldridge, Iowa this year. It won at Oskaloosa, Iowa. It's won in the last couple years as well, 2018 and 2019. So, and this is also an ironclad, so a great 3.4 maturity Roundup 2 Extend. 
So I know I covered a lot of varieties. Hopefully you can pause and look at the data cl more, more closely, but I'm really proud of the performance. And if you need more performance or results about any Latham variety, we've got a whole host of different products that can be the right fit on your farm. Give us a call, give your Latham RSM a call, or give us a call at 877-GO-LATHAM and we'll get you the data you need. But otherwise I would say, have a happy Thanksgiving. Hope your family stays safe and healthy and we'll talk to you again soon. Thanks so much.